Dream, and today I'm gonna to share with you guys some of my affordable farmhouse decor. So these are pieces, some of the pieces I just picked up, some of the pieces I have actually had for a while, but these are pieces that I absolutely love and they are at a great, great price. So let's just jump right into this video. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I'm gonna talk about is this table. And I absolutely love it so much. It is from Hobby Lobby and it was $36.99. And I think that is a great price for a little side table. Also in this video towards the end, I'm gonna show you how I style each of the pieces in my home. So how I use them in my home, if I've used them yet. Some of the pieces I have not yet hung up or um, put together so we cannot see how I style those but follow me on Instagram so you get up-to-date information on my life how I'm living what I'm doing with the kids and just any decor pieces anything new or anything like that that's in my home but yeah this piece Hobby Lobby I love Hobby Lobby for small pieces like this because that their furniture is always 30% off like done deal 30% off Sometimes you're gonna catch it on an even bigger sale, especially when the seasons are changing, they will mark it down even further. But as a base price, their furniture is always gonna be 30% off. I have a few Hobby Lobby pieces of furniture in my house and they have held up just great. The next we're gonna talk about is Target. And I think to cozy up any home or just to make it feel warm, you need to add some greenery. And I like to use different textures of greenery, but greenery needs to be added. So um, first at Target, they have these two. Um, this one is $4.99 and it is from the Hearth and Hand Collection. For such a small price, you can make such a big impact in your home on a tear tray or inside of a hutch or anything like that by just adding a little pop of green. And I also really enjoy the terracotta pot that it comes in. On the same note, they have this one that is the Project 62 brand. And then this has a little bit of height. You can see it's a little bit bigger than this one. So this one I actually have styled in my bedroom on a little tray at the edge of my bed. It gives that perfect pop of green. I love the white container that it comes in and it just fills in, it can fill in a space. Um, it has like faux dirt on the bottom, which you can't see, but I just love it and it's really cute and it just gives a perfect amount of green to any small area in your home. The next thing we're gonna talk about is um, Amazon. So from Amazon, I picked up this a while back. And if you see, if you follow me on Instagram and I'm taking pictures of us anywhere in our living room, this is always in the shot. And this was a piece, it was $14.99 from Amazon. As you know, Amazon, they change their prices all the time. So you'll probably get it for even lower. You can get it for $9.99 or $13 or $15.99. The prices fluctuate all the time. But when I purchased it, I got these four pieces for just a low, low, low price of $14.99. And then these come out, so you can use this tray by itself. Or you can use one or all three of them. I style this in my home. I put um, hydrangeas in each of the area and it just gives it a great pop and that little farmhouse feel to any home. Okay, next, you guys are gonna see a trend. I love woods, I love white, I love metals. Um, the next thing would be this metal piece. And this I have styled in my living room. It actually hangs on the wall. I have a little bit of greenery inside of it. This greenery I actually picked up from um, Target, the Target dollar spot. But these just hang on my wall. They have the little notch there. And they are from Walmart. Yes, Walmart. So I got two, they were about $12.99. And I got two for this size. Like that is a price that you cannot beat. And the impact that it adds in your home the warmth is just out of out of out of control but this is so cute and i have it styled in my living room and i'll show you guys later um just against the wall and it gives a great backdrop to um a really pretty area cozy pretty area in my living room but for 13.99 walmart 
two of them, you're not gonna beat that price. So another way I like to cozy up my space is by adding in books. And I like to shop for books at two different places. And these are books that I actually read. So there are also books that I get from the dollar store and I can remove the covers and you can decorate them different ways for different seasons and make them neutral decor. But these are books that I like to have sitting around my house that are cozy that people can pick up to read. So this one is called Homebody. And if you guys haven't got your hands on this one and the Magnolia story, which I loved the, Man the Magnolia story so much, um, buy it. I so you can style it even with the cover on, like I you'll see that I have, or it is so cute without it on as well. It's just a really good book. I got mine from Amazon for about $19.99. But another place that I love to get books, and I actually purchased the Magnolia story from, it is Hobby Lobby. And I got it for just a few dollars, and their books are always on sale. Like, it's a constant sale. So that's just a really great place to go pick up books, to um, furnish up your house, and just to add a little cozy touch to your farmhouse decor. Okay, next, I am obsessed with bird houses, bird cages, any of that stuff. So I picked up these from Michaels and this was only like five, this one was five bucks. And then the large one, it may have been cheaper than that. And the large one, and you can see I just have it styled with some greenery in it. The large one was only so this one was seven, so this one maybe was like four, but I love to pick these up when they are off season because normally they're gonna run between, so this one probably would have been like $29.99 and this one a little bit more. Um, they're gonna run that price, but when they are off season and we're moving into the new season, you can get them for such a great deal. So for a few dollars, I picked up these birdhouses. They're in a very neutral tone and I cannot wait to style them for fall. I have them out already and I'll show you how, how I have them in my home now, but great touches. And I have these out all year round, even though some people may say they're spring or summery or anything like that. I just have them all year round and they're just a great farmhouse touch. And then next also um, from Michaels, I picked up this little, canister and like I said this is another one of those things that you want to pick up when it is off season it originally was $24.99 and while that isn't a bad price and then this is how it looks I'm just not going to pay $24.99 for this but I will pay like five bucks and I think that's how much I got it for. So, and this is a nice tin piece. It's um, good quality. And this is something that you can just change out your florals inside of it and have it in your house all year around. So this is like a decor staple pieces. I think all of the decor I'm talking about today, even though it's really affordable, they're staple pieces that you can build onto. Any, you can build, have a, as a base for your home decor and then build onto them. So this little piece for five bucks, you can't beat it. And then you can put in any florals that you would like. I got these also from Michaels, they were off season. So I got them for just a few bucks and I think they look beautiful. And then my last find, and I was so happy about this find. And I actually picked up two of them. And if you're on my Instagram, you already saw it. But it is this little, um, these picture frames. And like I said, I picked up two. And guys, guess how much they were a piece? $12. Like, I cannot. I ordered some photos from Shutterfly that would fit in here. Um, but I am so excited. And they have this cream color and then just... Um, the wood here and it's gonna look so cute I'm gonna flank it with my I have a little book type shelf in um, the room that I'm currently in and I'm gonna put them on either side of that and it is just going to give it such a great little touch and I'm so excited and I can't wait to get it up get them up and get them the pictures in them but for $12 you can't beat it and this I picked up from Joann's 
it was off season. We're out of the season where they're gonna have this, but guess what? It's neutral decor. It's something that you can have up in your house all year around. So for 12 bucks, you can't beat that. And originally these were, I don't even see a price, but they probably were, we have two old sale prices, probably $49.99 or maybe $50.99. They probably were somewhere around there, but so cute and I love them and I picked up two. So two for 24, such a great deal. And then my last piece is my weighted scale. And I have wanted a weighted scale for actually some time now. I'll take these off. I feel like it's gonna hit me in my face. Um, I have actually wanted a weighted scale for a long time now. And the best one for the best price that I found was at Kirkland's. And this one was only $39.99. And these things can run a pretty penny. So I just love this one that I picked up and it has the two little houses and it is just perfect and I love it. And for that price, I don't think you can beat it. Oh, see, I think it's gonna hit me in the face. The next item is, I got them in a huge bag. For $13.99 are these hooks. Um, these hooks are like farmhouse hooks and you can see over here that they are on hung up on my wall. I will tell you, they do come with screw, screws. We got um, 12 for just $12.99, so just a dollar a piece. They come with screws, but my husband said we needed different screws. So we use different screws um, in there. He said it just would be better if you're gonna anchor it to the wall not to use these. So we use different screws since I was gonna be hanging different decor pieces off of it. And I just painted them with a little black paint that I picked up from Hobby Lobby so that they could match the black color of the hook. But 12 came in a pack. So you can use these as um, hooks for your towels in your bathroom, in your mud area or laundry room. You can use the, these as hooks in there and they just add that really cute farmhouse touch. I'm just gonna show you guys how I styled a few of the items. So we have one of the larger bird cages that I got from Michaels. Some of that greenery that I also got from Michaels. I can't wait to fall to put either pumpkins or something pretty awesome in there. I have the book. It's just sitting on top of the book. And then I have that little end table from um, Hobby Lobby. And then this area also has this stuff. So these I just have on this wall. There's also a sign here. I love that sign. That's like my favorite saying. But I just have these styled with um, some more of those little picks that you guys can get. And you can change it out to go along with whatever season hits you. So whatever season that um, you want to decorate. So fall, you can put, put more like amber tones and then darker tones, Christmas, maybe some red or just maybe some frosted flowers would be really cute um, to put in there. Or you can have neutral flowers that you can have in there all year around. But that's just how, how I have this area styled using some of those things from the video here so I have these this pretty greenery which I said my tip is to get it when it is off season um, but I have this pretty greenery that I got for near nothing um, styled in just this little flower container and this flower another off season item but it can be a staple in your house all year round you can change out the greenery to go along with whatever you are doing and then you guys can see i use those hooks those hooks are so versatile but this is just how i use them and style them in my home and then the same thing with the bench I just put the little bird cage on it. I kind of like having it empty right now, but I can't wait till fall to put pumpkins and all of that stuff in it. I'm so excited, but I just have it styled like that. I have um, the weighted scale styled as show. Like I said, Kirkland's had the best deal um, to get it. And I just have it with some of these little balls that I also got from Michaels. And it's just on top of 
this piece of furniture. But yeah, and then those pictures that I showed you guys, I'm gonna hang them on each side of this wall to make it a little bit more complete. So in my living room, this is how I have these pieces styled, just very simple and easy. Um, we use this table all the time, so I can't have too much clutter on this table. The flowers in the center, I change out to go along with the seasons. Hydrangeas are my absolute favorite. So um, they're my favorite to have up all year round, but I do change out the florals in the middle to um, go with whatever season we're in. And now we're gonna head upstairs. I just have it on a tray with um, one of our favorite books and a little photo album and it just adds that nice little touch. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Um, I love making videos on home decor and I love making videos on cleaning motivation and organizing. All of those things are my thing. So if you guys like that content, don't forget to um, subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.